morning dear students in today's class we'll see the solution of homogeneous partial differential equation involving derivation derivatives with respect to one independent variable see uh, we have seen in the previous class the same examples but you can find here so it is a function of z and we have the same variable means the same uh, here also z and here same variables are there then such kind of uh, equations are going to called as what here uh, homogeneous and in the pre previous class we have seen see the differential equation here also we have differential equation but here function uh, this derivative is function of z but here the variables are x and y non homogeneous so such kind of sir, uh, equations are going to call non homogeneous but way of proceeding same but a small change in this example and in this example so this examples already we have completed in the previous class uh, in today's class we will see so solve dou square z upon dou x square plus z equal to 0 given that when x is equal to 0 z is e raised to y and when x is equal to 0 dou z by dou x is equal to 1 these are the conditions and we have we need to apply so it is same as uh, how we have done previous uh, classes examples now the given differential equation if the functions are uh, function and the variable are same so we need to convert this in the in terms of our uh, ordinary differential equation form means this dou by dou x you convert in terms of d by dx form so here dou square z upon dou x square is there so it will be converted in terms of d square z upon dx square plus z so this can be written as d square z plus z equal to 0 or you take z common so left what inside here d square plus 1 so from this you can see the right hand side is uh, equal to 0 means this is not of any kind of type here so this is uh, for only we will get complementary function so auxiliary equation is d square plus 1 equal to 0 or this can be uh, find, found like that and uh, this is nothing but a uh, root of the given differential equation so which is nothing but a uh, complex uh, uh, free from a uh, real part only real imaginary part is there so which can be written as zc instead of y we are taking z because this is the equation in terms of z so therefore um, we have to take uh, complementary function of z is equal to c1 cos x plus c2 sin x but we have to replace c1 as f of y and c2 as g of y and uh, this zc you consider as a z and because here no uh, com in particular integral so zc is nothing but a general solution or complete solution so therefore by replacing c1 as a fy and uh, c2 as gy we can say that it is a, a complete solution with f of y and g of y so the solution is z is equal to f of y instead of c1 i had taken here uh, f of y cos x plus instead of c2 i had taken g of y sin x u equation number one now go back to the condition they have given when x is equal to 0 z is e raised to y so apply these values in equation number one so when x is 0 you replace wherever x is there you replace 0 and z is equal to e raised to y so z is equal to e raised to y means here replace z as e raised to y is equal to f of y as it is cos of 0 because x is there in place of x 0 plus g of y as it is sin of 0 so on simplification e raised to y as it is f of y cos of 0 is 1 1 into f of y is f of y but sin of 0 is 0 that's why 0 into g of y is 0 so therefore we got the value of f of y is equal to e raised to y so keep this one as it is now with the second condition when x is equal to 0 dou z by dou x is equal to 1 but in the equation number 1 we don't have dou z by dou x so before applying this uh, to, uh, condition value we need to uh, differentiate equation number 1 partially with respect to x see I have done here so this z is nothing but it will become dou z by dou x f of y is a constant partial derivative of cos x is nothing but what here minus times sin x plus g of y is a constant keep as it is partial derivative of sin x with respect to x partial is nothing but what here it is cos x so simplify 
uh, or else you can apply these conditions directly here so dou z by dou x is nothing but 1 minus f of y as it is x is 0 that is sine of 0 plus uh, g of y as it is cos of 0 because x is 0 so on simplification sine 0 is 0 0 into anything is 0 1 as it is so cos of 0 uh, cos of 0 is 1 1 into g of y is g of y so on simplification g of y is 1 so substitute f of y and g of y in your equation number 1 so replace this f of y as e raised to y and g of y as 1 so we will get a required equation as z is equal to e raised to y cos x plus sin x so in this way we need to simplify for a partial differential equation of homogeneous okay so the next example is